farm hands farm by reef here so on today's episode we're going to talk about the sulfur uh, test kit this is the the no3 uh, nitrate i'm going to show you guys how to uh, step by step do these tests so what i'm going to do for you guys today i have new tank water and i have some old tank water so i got two samples here we're going to do two of them at the same time i'm going to show you what a good uh, sample looks like and what a bad sample looks like all right guys so let's move in here quick and um, we're going to do this together and i'm going to show you guys the results all right, gang, so here we go. So we got everything all laid out. We have our two test vials. We have our first sample of water and we have our other sample of water. So this one should be really good uh, test and this one should be a, a bad test. So what we're gonna do here is we need to take our two milliliter syringe and we gotta take a sample from each one and it just needs to be one mil each. So we just take up, uh, make sure you get all our air bubbles out. We're gonna move this plunger to the one mil mark. So make sure you get rid of all your excess uh, water. So here we go. And we're gonna move into the first test. And then put this one to the side, I'm gonna grab another syringe. We're gonna get another one mil sample as well. So let's move that one right down to the one mil mark. So you guys can see, and we're gonna put that in the other sample. So let's put those all to the side. So what we need to do now is you need to take your NO3, shake it up a bit. We're gonna add four drops per test. All right, guys? So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we got that in. So what we need to do now, we don't shake it right now. What we're gonna do is we have to take the NO3-2 powder and our little spoon, and we need to put two, put one each in each uh, test vial. So, and just make sure it's level. So you guys see how that's nice and level? So we add that to the first one. Don't shake it yet. And let's do another, uh, the other sample. Make sure it's level, just like that. We'll put that to the side. And then what we're gonna do, is we're gonna shake these for 30 seconds. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right, so we got our two tests uh, done. So what we have to do now is we have to let this sit for uh, three minutes and we're gonna use our card. It goes from zero to 100 and we wanna be down into the zeros and twos, but nothing over like 10 to 100. So what we have to do is set a timer. So let's ask Suri. Suri, set my timer for three minutes, please. Okay, three minutes and counting. So now we're gonna watch these uh, vials change color. In three minutes, we'll have our results. All right, so it's been three minutes. Let's shut our timer off. So here we go, guys. You can see the difference in the colors. So this, you know, this sample here is really bad. If we look here, this is like a 50 to 100, so that means we need to do a drastic water change ASAP. And then if we see our other sample here, this one here is reading more into the zero and the two. So this is what you're looking for when you do your test, guys. All right, and this one, look at that one. You guys can judge that sample and then this sample. All right, gang, so that's how you uh, you test uh, the NO3 uh, nitrate from uh, Solifert. So this is what you see, guys. The one on the right looks like you want to do a water change ASAP, and the one on the left is looking great. So you just take it and you look at uh, your little chart, and you guys can be the judge. So this is how you uh, mix this up. It's so easy to do. So I hope you guys really like this episode. If you guys could please subscribe and hit the like button.